M0 FXB, just a quick one. Someone asked me to show the ICOM 705 and the ICOM 7300 together, okay? So here they are. Now, my 705 has got a carry cage on it. What's the number one difference? This, the 705, is a shack in the box. It has GPS, Bluetooth, and it covers, if we tap the bands here on both, 1.8 all the way up to 430 megahertz and airband as well and that is fantastic look at that so uh let's just go tap this and go back to where we were now you can band stack on both of these meaning that each time you press the the seven megs it will go now let's just we've got similar antennas i suppose you've got a g5rv on the top one and on the bottom one, we've got a very long wire, 66 foot length of wire with a 49 to 1 balance. Let's turn down the... Uh, 7300, quite a small speaker on the 705. But you can add an external speaker if you turn it down and you turn... Turn your noise reduction on. You've got noise reduction on both of these sets. So you're just listening to the 7300 now. Again, again. Now what I'll say is that if you want a good, solid HF 6 meter and 4 meter set, go for the 7300. It's a 100 watts, it's got a built-in tuner. The 705 has got no tuner, but it is a shack in the box and it does do D star. If we hold down the DR button, we're in D star mode. And if I turn on my hotspot or go to my D star repeater, it's going to work great. And that's the thing here. I know you've also got Wi Fi. Let's just hold this down. You've also got Wi Fi. So if you're a QRP person that wants to do a bit of everything and then interact with software using Wi Fi, you've got terminal mode or Bluetooth where you can interact then go for the 705 but it when you hold this set this is a 1400 pound set even with reduction you might get brand new 1300 yeah you don't actually get a lot of radio i'll show you you can see there it's a small brick where the 7300 is um you get you know you this is the biggest thing i would say when you're buying when you choose between these two sets yeah and that is, you get a hell of a radio when you buy the 7300 for about £1,200. I mean, look at the new FTX1, you know? This is a field version, okay? Now, that's £1,500, and you get that. But it is, this is like two radios in one. It does twin C4FM, and it'll do HF, 6 meters, all that. It's fantastic radio. Um, you can buy the, what they call the Optima, which clips onto the back, and that brings it in line with, you know, the more of the Yesu style radios, like the 710. And I love the 710, don't get me wrong, it's one of my favourite radios. And with the 710, you get the external display. So, you know, we are spoilt for choice these days, and, uh, you know, I, I will find it very hard to choose if I was in a ham radio shop. Um, but if someone said, look, I just want to do HF, I'd say get yourself a 7300. Buy yourself a dual band mobile radio, you know, like uh, you can see down there we've got the FTM 500 or the 150. That's probably what I'd recommend is, is a good value setup. And you're going to be very happy with that. I mean, look at that, yeah. It's just beautiful. But if you want to play around with GPS and Wi-Fi settings, I mean, the settings menu on this thing is amazing. They both record, they both have very similar uh, functions. It's just the 705 has a lot more. There's your Wi-Fi set there, look, and Bluetooth. USB, mine's got USB-C charging. The battery on the back of these is the same as what's in your handheld, your ID52 and the 51 that's quite unique you haven't you know but these days with battery bank technology now these days even the 7300 you could there's battery banks out there now sorry about i'm trying to get the the brightness right in this small little shack but i thought someone asked me to show them together bluetooth microphone and speaker on this
you can't do that with the 7300. Uh, they're both going to work great on FT8, but QRP. But these days, you get yourself something like a, a micro PA50 amplifier. Um, this is going to give you 50 watts straight away. An antenna tuner, you don't have an antenna tuner with the 705. But again, you know, I've got a little tuner here. Let me just grab it. Um, ATU100M Pro built-in battery. And that thing will, will run this radio all day long. You know, the top one. The bottom one has emergency tuning as well. 7300, if you turn that on, it will tune past 3.1. And it will pretty tune anything, that will. But it will, it will limit the power to, to 50 watts. But, I mean, they're just fantastic sets, full stop. So, it is interesting, you know. But, I think if I just went out and I was buying a radio, I'd feel happier coming home with a nice big set like this. The 705, it will, I'd probably get a um, shock of spending that amount of money on such a small radio. But, you are paying for the technology, and that's what's happening with this FTX1. You're paying for the latest technology, the research and development costs that all come with that. So they both got massive memories. You know, you've got M pads here, record. Just click the, they are, and two, and two. Let's go two on this. Look at all the extra things there because you've got um, terminal mode, DV gateway there. Um, and you can send photographs with the, on D star with, well, it doesn't even have to be using DR mode, I believe. You can send it from person to person in, in DV mode. So D star, of course, no D star on the 7300. And you're not going to be able to listen to your air band on your 7300 where you are on this. Uh, filters, you've got the filters there. And here, filters as well. Or you can tap the screen as well. So auto, like uh, voice guide on both. Voice guide here, auto tune, CW works great on both. Smaller VFO, but very smooth, small VFO. Of course, you can add memories, you can use the RSBA1 software and remotely control both these radios at home with your laptop, your PC, around your house, in your garden. Or you can go around the world and as long as you set this thing to come on, and it can be done, there's timers built into this set as well there is on the 7610 and i'm not sure about this one noise blanker noise reduction notch preamps there i think you've got that all in here within the menu structure somewhere look at the gps there gps information we've actually got a lock there and there's my location and you can tinker with these radios all day long and the deeper you delve into the functions you know, watch lots of videos, read the manual. The more you're going to enjoy these radios, you've got buttons here. Menu, function, M-scope, quick and exit. So M-scope, function, and you've got Vox, and then go menu, scope. It just, it just goes on forever. Memory, very easy to save memories. Bandage, so thanks for watching my channel. I thought I'd show them together. Let me know if I've missed anything. And you know, £1,400, £1,200, and there is discounts available. Bye for now, 73.